All right, good morning, everybody. Kilt here. Morning of day 167, 167 on trail. Coming at you from the Appalachian Trail in the 100 Mile Wilderness. Today is day five in the 100 Mile Wilderness. We've got a pretty big mile day today. We're heading to the Rainbow Ledges Rainbow Shelter lean-to, a little over 18 miles. It is 7.20 in the morning, and we are getting ready to push north. Just here loading up last minute items at the shelter. Two knees is under there, it's dark, you can't see. But uh, quiet night, cool night, and we are under overcast skies, so we are Playing with fate with the weather, but we're gonna get there. Um, I'm running real low on batteries, so I'm gonna keep everything short and sweet. Just try to pick up the highlights throughout the day and uh, conserve batteries. I've only got one one bar left on my battery bank, and I've got today and tomorrow and a wake up to uh, keep things charged. And the watch and Garmin need a daily charge. So let me get off here, get heading down here, top our water off, and then we are pushing north. We'll bring you back up trail. Hope you got your cup of coffee. If not, go top it off. We'll be right back. See you in a bit. Here is our morning trail. Oh, look. There's a canoe over here. Oh yeah, to go. Now they said to pick you up in a power boat if you call. But that may be a spot to call from. Oh, that's pretty cool. Says there is a, so why am I turning? Because the sign says that there's possibly a view of Katahdin from over here on the shoreline, which is 16 miles line of sight, so says the book. But I think the overcast is gonna obstruct that. But we'll take a quick peek. Yeah, that's chained up, locked up. Go out here to the lake real fast. Nope. It would be out there if you could see it. Still pretty though. Still pretty on the lake. Yep. Don't see it nowhere. Still chugging along in this beautiful terrain. Now we're going next to another stream. Absolutely gorgeous. This entire wilderness that we're in, the 100 mile wilderness, is just splattered with many ponds and lakes and these channels and streams that connect. It's an epic playground for canoe camping. All right, still cruising along next to the same stream river. Come to the intersection of the first shelter. We're gonna pop in here for a second breakfast. Get in, get out. You can see the shelter straight ahead. Pretty new one too. 
pretty new shelter. Very nice. All right. We are going to have no nameplate. We're going to have a quick second breakfast and push on. There we go. Just popped out the little side trail from, there was a little state campground up there, but this is a big old lake. Come right out to the beach. A couple, uh, couple canoes or boats out there, like three of them, all the little John boats. So somebody got back in here somewhere. It's pretty cool. Very nice. Nope. Beautiful, beautiful. Right. That right there is nesting bunt. That's the. Which one? Uh, no, actually, I think. That little one? This little one on the left should be nesting bunt. Yeah. That one there might be. Hmm, I'm not sure. I don't want to. I don't know. It's not rainbow. Anyway, push it north. All right, we're on trail, and the trail brings you right out to this beach now. It's all the same lake, but we're way up, way up the side, going clockwise. A little fishing boat out there. All right, there's the trail up here. Get out of this, get out of this gravel, get out of my shoes. All right, continuing on around the lake. All right, everybody, we are here at the Wadley Shelter. We just got here, had lunch. Uh, didn't film rolling in because there was hikers here, but they've already rolled out. Now it's just uh, Toonie and myself. Nice little shelter right here on the stream. Uh, you can't really see it, but it's gonna be right over here behind us running down the whole front of the front of the shelter Had a good lunch a couple wraps a little made the pack a little lighter feeling better Foot is still really really aggravated um, I'm just glad we're this close to the end because I don't have any more days. I can actually hike on it It's getting it's getting worse by the day. Let's put it that way went from better to not so much better um, That's it. Just had a good lunch. We have to do this last little 800 foot climb and then uh, we'll be on our way, heading into our shelter for the end of the day. We got about seven, eight more miles. We're just over 10 in, so I can't remember what the total for the day was, but we got less to do today than we started, than we've done already today. So that's the good news. All right, saving battery, pushing north, see you up trail. All right, we've already come down the back side of the Nuisant Bunt last mountain and last view that we had of the lake. Come across the stream here for our last shot of water before we push on to the shelter. Just sitting here taking it in and not and just grasping the fact, look at the trees and all the colors that they've changed. That winter is coming. It has taken me this long to get this far. The greens, the yellows, the oranges, the reds, the browns. Like fall is here and it's full swing in the north. So we gotta go up and cross over that bridge and then go up and take the trail. Last shot of water before the shelter. Just filling everything up. Gorgeous, simply gorgeous.
just some late afternoon trail. Hey, good evening everybody. Kilt here. We are in the shelter. Oh, don't do that. It's a family channel. Two knees doesn't have clothes on again. I swear, old people sometimes. I gotta ask you to put pants on. Really? I have pants on. So, we made it to the shelter. It was a long day. The last two and a half miles were not so friendly as the rest of the day was. We did make it up over the Bunston... Nimrod Mountain. No. <laughs> Anyway, we'll show you when we get to the book. Got it up over that mountain. That was an 800 foot climb. A stone stair, so it wasn't bad. But we made it to the Rainbow Stream Lean-To Shelter. That was our goal for the day. Sets us up for a full day, 15 mile even hike tomorrow. And uh, we'll be at A-Ball Bridge. So we're here, we're changed, getting ready to do dinner. Bedding's all set up there behind me. So you can see that. And uh, we just get you, let me get you turned around and show you the book. All right, so we started the morning right there at the Pate Wajo Spring Shelter at 2144.8. And you can see the terrain cruising, cruising, cruising. Oh, it was beautiful terrain all morning. Got there to the Nahamkananta Stream Shelter. We had second breakfast. Rolled out of there really quick. Continued on, more flat land. Just really enjoying it. Right. Had a great day. Got to the bottom of the page, so you know what we got to do. We got to turn the page. All right, there we go. And then we stopped in at the Wadley Stream Shelter for lunch. And that's where the climb was at. So it's the Nesson Bunt Mountain. That was the what it was. So we climbed up the Nesson Bunt Mountain, had a quick snapshot photograph view, and then right down the other side as quick as possible. Come all the way down through, all the way up through the Poly Gorge, all up into here, and ended right here at Rainbow hey. Stream Lean To at mile 2163 even on day 167 for a grand total of an 18.2 mile day at 1,001 feet. Big day, and that only leaves, come on, 30.1 miles remaining of the whole journey. All right, so that's it for the end of the day wrap up. Uh, again, this is day, so today is day five, day five in the 100 mile wilderness, day 167 in the books. And we are one more day and we'll be pushed on out and into Baxter State Park. I want to say thank you to all for tuning in and following along. Hope you had a good day and enjoyed the video. If you want to see more, you know what to do. Set that coffee pot to auto. Get your fresh cup of joe first thing in the morning and we'll be back. You can join us for our day hike through the, through the Appalachian Trail going northbound 2021. Have a good night, everybody. Again, my name is Kilt. I'll see you first thing in the morning. Bye-bye.